Hey everybody, Thomas here. Thank you as always for joining me. I hope you all had a wonderful week and a wonderful weekend, but I need to give you all a quick personal update. Uh, sorry about the mailbag uh, yesterday, guys, but I will be returning it to its full glory on the 23rd next Monday. A whole lot of new books uh, in the pipeline, so look forward to that. But this, this week, uh, I needed a little bit of time to myself. Uh, this update will explain everything, and it will mainly be meaningful to those of you who have been following my channel for several months. Uh, you will have been aware of the situation last summer uh, with my father having to go into the hospital at the beginning of August. And what this essentially became was it was the long, drawn-out, steady decline towards the inevitable, as it were. And the inevitable finally occurred. On January 28th, my father passed away, and... Uh, we had the memorial service on the 13th, Friday the 13th of this month. Now, with that finally all behind us, it does feel like, you know, my dad has kind of closed the book on the story of his life and has wished us well and time to move on, as it were. You will have noticed that during sort of all of this time, I have been maintaining a sense of, you know, even in the last couple of weeks, a sense of routine and regularity to the channel. Uh, and I've been doing that in other areas of my life. That's just uh, the sort of thing that I do. I'm, you know, I'm not necessarily a workaholic kind of person, but when very stressful and emotionally fraught situations come around, I find that throwing myself into my work is a thing that helps me feel focused and grounded. And then in being so grounded, I feel like I can be a much, much better help to my mother when I've been spending a lot of time with her lately. I, I've basically been spending my weeks at her house and then my weekends down here uh, just sorting out affairs of my own. There's there's no one right way and there's no real wrong way of, of processing things like this when they come up in your life. Everyone has to do what is right for them. You know, I feel like it is a good time to just sort of move ahead because that's what needs to happen. That's how life works. It just keeps going. But for this week though, it's interesting. This week suddenly, I guess, being the decompression week, the de-stress week, uh, the week when suddenly everything is, is finally lifted and we're free to miss my dad, but at the same time feel a definite sense of relief that he is no longer experiencing that painful decline. I mean, he was literally, he was just like a zombie at the end. It was a very, very sad thing to see. And we certainly know that he would not have wanted that. I guess the decompression from all of that is now what is hitting me this week. And uh, when I was thinking about, okay, I gotta get set up and get the lights going and get all the packages ready and start making some more content and videos. And I looked at it and I'm like, I just can't. Um, today, this week, it's just not on, you guys. <laughs> I need time for me. I need time to rest. I need time to just play with my dogs and wink and read some books and play some games and watch some movies and eat Chinese food and Thai food and <laughs> just not worry about stuff for a bit. You know, talk on the phone with my mom, visit with her some more, that kind of thing. Me time. So I hope you all understand. As far as the channel goes, I have come up with uh, some really neat ideas for a variety of content. Also, I'm planning on doing a little bit of traveling this year. I'm thinking very strongly about going to the Nebula Awards weekend, uh, as well as World Fantasy, and uh, thinking about how fun it would be to vlog uh, those events for the channel. So just different ideas, different approaches to, to bring a bit of freshness to the content here. You know, attract more viewers, get those subs in, and just boost the lovely, wonderful SFF180 family that you all have become to me. All of the support and uh, encouragement all of you guys have given uh, the channel here ever since its inception. I, I, I appreciate it so much. I really couldn't do it without all of you. I've enjoyed uh, the friends that I've made uh, among other booktubers and um, you know just sharing the love of SFF with all of you. And that's going to continue as I sort of uh, you know explore some new ideas as we move forward. So thanks everyone for understanding. I hope you guys have a fantastic week, whether you're snowed in or whatever is, is going on at the moment. Until I see you all next time, thanks again and uh, happy reading.